In Bugsy Allen, a laid off Keystone Pipeline worker. Bugsy, good morning to you. Welcome back to our program. Love the hat. How's your life been over the past six, seven months? Been pretty boring. Man can't find a job nowhere. And uh, this administration going back to the OPEC, all they're doing is circling the wagon. He needs to have a billboard put up in front of him and say, look, we can do our own energy. We had it going on the whole time. Donald J. Trump had America first, the America workers first, the oil and gas first. It didn't matter what you was in. You had plenty of jobs. There's thousands of families hurting out there. We've got it right here at our fingertips. Why not use it? Why? I cannot figure this. This, this beats anything I have ever seen about American president. There's something that is totally wrong with this administration. What do you hear from, you know, your, your friends, colleagues, workers? Um, you know, it's, it's, it seems to me that no one is listening to common sense. Well, that, that's, that's the truth. Everybody that I know, they're fishing because that's all they got to do. Mm. They ain't no work. All we're doing is sitting here on hold. We're not being able to get out there and prosper our family, not one bit. And Biden says he's a big union man. Well, I've been a member of the 798 Pipeliners Union out of Tulsa, Oklahoma for 21 years. He cut us to nothing. We can't, we can't go on our pensions. We can't mm -hmm. our insurance. This man don't have a clue what he's doing well, to the American people. Uh, Bugsy, and, and, and what do you think? About it is, yeah, I, I apologize for interrupting. Uh, um, how do you react when they go to OPEC a couple times now in a month and trying to encourage them to pump more? And even Moscow, for that matter, right? I mean, you're trying to ask Vladimir Putin to, you know, help us out economically. It just seems kind of mm. upside down, well, doesn't it? From a country boy's perspective, common horse sense, there's it's all due to money. Every bit of this has got to do to money somehow. There's underhanded money, just like there's six trillion dollars that they want to do for the infrastructure. Do you realize how much you can skim off the of six trillion dollars? They can pay all of us billions and not even know it. Mm. Instead of just saying, look, we're going to take care of our own, our own United States of America that we have been blessed with so well, with so many riches of the deep that, you know what, we're just going to go here and we're going to try to prosper these other countries. It's something to do with money somewhere down the line. Well